Hello Aishman. Hello. Uh, today I just heard that you are going to cook something in my channel today. So what are you planning to cook? So today I will, I'm going to cook Caribbean fried rice and for the recipe stay tuned. So I see a lot of ingredients here. I think here you have some veggies, so carrots, two carrots chopped down, one small potato chopped down, one small onion chopped down and here I think we have some uh, I, this are sausages, chicken sausages and uh, it's a, a kebab. Alright and one egg also. I think you also have uh, one bowl of rice and um, this is the refined oil and uh, you just need oyster sauce and soy sauce all right so you don't plan to use any of what do you call chilies no no right let's get going you've already put the gas on flame all right and then yes okay get going how, how much oil have you put in I two think it's around two teaspoons of oil. All right, very less oil. Okay, healthy, huh? Okay, let the oil heat up. So I can see you've chopped down the kebab and the sausages. So what are you planning to do now? So now I pour the veggies. Right, in goes the onions. Right, be careful. So you are putting the onions and the veggies all together. Yes. Yeah. You are putting the flame on low. Yes. Okay. So after it is golden brown, we will take it out and pour some more oil and then fry the uh, sausages. Uh, uh, I guess you need to put some salt there. Yes. Yes. So salt according to taste, right? So we'll just put the lid on top for some time and let it rest. So I just saw that you did not let the onions caramelize. Immediately with the onions you have put in the vegetables, is it? Yes, then the flavor comes to the rice. Okay. While the veggies uh, are cooking up, uh, I have put the uh, one more karhai on flame and now I will cook these chicken sausages and kebabs. So let's put in one and see if the oil is hot or not. Yes, it's quite hot. So let's put in some more. And now, as it is becoming hot, we'll put oil and we'll fry it till it becomes golden brown. Okay, so we'll put the flame on low and see if the veggies are cooked up or not. quite nice. The oil is moving off. Um, I'll increase it a bit and then saute it for some more time so that it can become golden brown. Okay, so we have to work on both sides here. Now, uh, as you can see, it has become little bit yellowish. So, it will just turn into golden brown. So, we have put it on low. And it's time for this to cook on home. and separating it so that the oil comes here. Now I will pour in the egg. Now we have to scramble it so that uh, it goes nice with the fried rice. 
veggies and uh, I think it's uh, yeah the egg so now let's cook it okay I think it's the time to add the rice this is the main ingredient of our dish be careful we have to fry it in vigorously so that it doesn't stick on to the bottom of the panel. And as soon as you see that the veggies and the chicken is mixing up with the rice, you just add the oyster sauce first. After adding the oyster sauce, Soy sauce. I think this much is fine. So you like it very, very dark, I guess. Uh, because a lot it's of Caribbean stuff. fried rice, they like it dark. So as you can see, it has become quite dark, uh, and I like this color of the fried rice. We'll uh, let it cook for some time so that. The flavor, or the Caribbean flavor, comes through. What about the flame? Is it, it high or low? It should remain in high because uh, it's just for two or three minutes, not for five minutes. So we'll just take it out and now put on some salt. Just you have it. to be careful about the salt because in the soy sauce. Oyster sauce, all of them will have salt, I guess. Yes? Yes. Wow. So I've just put a little bit because we have put oyster sauce, soya sauce, and two times salt before uh, giving the rice. So, since when have you been cooking? Almost two months. Since two months, huh? I guess you're cooking from before. You forgot. Yes? So we'll just reduce the plate and check for the salt. So let's taste for the salt. Mmm, it's so delicious. It doesn't need more salt. So I think it's ready to be dished out. So just to break the monotony of the color, we will put some greens. So here's my bowl of Caribbean fried rice. I hope it's tasty like my mother's dish uh, and it will be very very tasty. I know that. So if you enjoyed this video, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.